And we begin the 4 o'clock with some breaking news this afternoon. The FBI is looking for the men who robbed an armored truck at a bank in the south suburbs. Good afternoon to you. I'm Lourdes Duarte. And I'm Ray Cordopassi in for Ben Bradley. WGN's Julian Cruz is live at the scene in Dalton with the very latest. Julian? Well, Ray and Lourdes, Dalton police and the FBI are looking for the three suspects who chose one of the busiest intersections in the village to strike, appearing to have targeted an ATM armored vehicle. I'm surprised they got away. This is a really busy intersection. Dalton motorists at congested Sibley and Lincoln Avenue, no doubt stunned to see the gunman just before the busy noon hour. Even though it's not too bad of a neighborhood, it, I guess anything can happen. The FBI investigating the brazen heist. Three masked men dressed in black clothing, investigators say, pulling handguns near the ATM machines of U.S. Bank. Judging by its location, this armored vehicle and the drivers inside finding themselves in the stick-up. Fortunately, nobody injured in the hair-raising incident. No word from the FBI on exactly how much was stolen. Nothing surprised me anymore. <laughs> One local resident we talked to theorizing that the robbers must have planned the heist. These guys knew what they were doing. They might have scouted this thing before. Somebody is, you know, they know what time to do it. Investigators, we are told, are studying surveillance video looking for clues to the three individuals who were seen fleeing in an automobile. Log on to our website for a link to the FBI tip line. In Dalton, Julian Cruz, WGN News. All right, Julian, thank you. All